All right, so this is a quick video explaining how to apply our letter stickers to split flaps. So what we're gonna need to do this is four uh, old hotel key cards or gift cards. Uh, we're gonna need a clear glass food storage container. We're gonna need some uh, plastic wrap and then a ruler or calipers and a hobby knife. So to get started, uh, we're gonna first make a little jig to hold these cards in place. So to do that, we're gonna take uh, three of our cards to surround it like this. And so we can just go ahead and tape these down into place. I'm gonna wanna make sure that this is nice and tight up against here to hold those cards, the split flaps in alignment. And once we've got that, these fit in here nicely, we're going to take our fourth card and this is what's going to allow us uh, to align the bottom of the letters consistently on all of the flaps. These flaps are 3.375 uh, inches tall and our letter stickers are three inches tall. So that leaves 0.375 inches um, and divide that by two. So we need to make a line or set up our alignment for the bottom of the letters uh, to be 0.1875 inches from the bottom. And so what we're gonna do here is just line this up with the bottom there. We're gonna just make a little mark on the tape on this side. And then same thing over here, align it, make a mark on the tape. And then we can take our fourth card and align it with those two marks. And then again, just tape that down in place. So now these fit underneath that. And so if we were to take one of these letters, say this I here and line it up the bottom of that, you can see we've got a nice margin on the top, which will be equal to the margin on the bottom. So one final thing we actually have to do to our jig here is we're gonna put some tape and we're gonna make some alignment marks to help us line up the sticker in the center uh, horizontally here. And so to do that, we've got some tape and we're again gonna take our calipers and this time, so flaps are 2.125 inches wide. And so we're gonna start by making a mark in the middle, which is 1.0625. So we'll just go ahead and, this doesn't have to be super exact because we're just using this uh, visually when we're putting those stickers in place. And so then we divide that in half again. And so it's 53.53125 uh, inches. And let's just make one of these marks on each side. So now that we've got our jig set up here to hold our flaps, we can work on the way that we're gonna apply the stickers, which is with our uh, storage container here. So we're gonna take some of our plastic wrap and we're gonna get enough of this to cover the top of that container. And the reason we want to use a glass container is so that the plastic wrap sticks really well to it. Um, and we're going to try and make this as flat as we can, get rid of all those wrinkles. So to apply our stickers now, um, I'm just going to use the hobby knife here to help peel up one of these stickers. And so we can just peel that off. And then we're going to take our container with the plastic wrap on the top side here. And we're gonna take the sticker, this letter A here, and we're gonna actually flip it over so that the sticky side is up. And we're gonna lay that down on our plastic wrap. And we can actually just flip this whole thing over and the static electricity is gonna hold that sticker in place. And so now we can just go ahead and line this up with those alignment marks 
and we're going to line it right to the bottom of that. And what we're going to do is we're going to just push down on this and then we can just pull it away. And our sticker is stuck to the flaps and we can just press down on it to make sure it's adhered everywhere. And so now if we slide this out you can see we've got our margin on the bottom. And so the final step is to just take our knife and fold this up a bit and we can just go and cut along the crease and there we go we have a letter applied to the flaps and so now if we were going to apply the next letter so the letter b what we're going to do is we're going to take away the bottom flap set that aside we're going to flip this the top half down put it in the bottom and then we would take our uh, next flap uh, like that this one doesn't have the notches punched out of it yet um, we would take the next flap next blank flap put it there and then we can apply the uh, B sticker to that and so that way this flap will have the top of the A and the bottom of the B and we can keep doing that through all of the letters that we want to apply to our flaps thanks for watching and I hope that this was helpful